hate thick papers like this. Do not use if your scalp is irritated. Do not use on bleached, permanently colored, or dry hair. We gonna pretend like we didn't hear that. Oof. Maybe I shouldn't leave it on for super long. Is this a mistake? I, I was aware that my hair was bleached and colored and I literally didn't listen. Um. Oh! Oh! Hey guys. I know you see the title and you're like, bro, what are you doing? And I'm here to tell you, but before you start going crazy, I gotta put on this shirt. Once I put this shirt on, this is my new hair dye shirt. My new crazy hair adventure shirt. Cause y'all know I have that other one, but it's still in Kentucky, I think. You read the title correctly. And I know this is kind of crazy cause it's just like, yeah, I'm on my natural hair journey. But let's be for real, this is not natural. This is not healthy. My hair is relatively healthy, but I'm not a big hair person like I was. And I think this really, really, really signifies it because I know people, People know that I bleach my hair and I dye my hair all the time and yeah, that's not healthy. But like, how far am I willing to go? I'm willing to go this far. I'm willing to go this far. And you guys are gonna go along this journey with me. I'm sorry if I disappointed anybody. Actually, I'm not sorry and I don't care because this is my hair. Like, there's some days where I just be thinking, I wanna grow it out super long again and then there's some days where I think, I wanna shave it again. There's literally no in between. So I know there's little like, you know, micro aggression or whatever but you'll have to cope let me get this thumbnail though okay yeah we're gonna make this quick as possible because i'm not trying to i really wanted to do this while the sun was still up but i got very much distracted okay before we get started let me just say i did watch a lot of videos a lot this is not going to be one of those videos because this is not the same as like dyeing my hair or bleaching my hair. Like I'm pretty much going to actually follow the instructions and from what I've been watching, you shouldn't leave a texturizer in for super long. You shouldn't leave anything in your hair for super long. And I really don't know why I'm doing this. Like I don't really care for like my texture. Like I don't really care that it's this texture. I just... I'm bored, like I always wanted, bruh, I really, when I went to the beauty supply store, I went for these cute, my sister's calling me. What should I do? I'm not gonna tell her I'm doing this. I turned my ringer off because I know she's gonna call back and I feel super bad, but I'm just gonna say I was in the shower. She's calling again. Man, but when I went to the beauty supply, I went for these butterfly clips and some new edge control, which is this got to be glue. That is it. And then I just looked and I was like, texture. Cause like, I was watching videos but I wasn't planning to do it. I was just like, well, I guess if you do, I don't know. I feel bad for ignoring my sister, but it's all right. But we gonna get straight into this cause I actually am really nervous and I just want to get it over with and I don't want to have to wait and wait and wait. I just want to get this over with. I got my camera in the sink, which is not very smart. This is what's inside the box. We got step three, natural hair milk. By the way, I got the kids version because I'm real scared. Like I wasn't just going crazy. I, actually, I was thinking a little bit. Step two, neutralizing shampoo, liquid activator. So that's an important ingredient. You got this, natural oils. This is to add before texturizing. To dry hair. So I'm gonna apply this to my hair. My hair's already dirty by the way. I'm not taking any chances. Like I'm not trying to look a mess. This is what's gonna be added to the texture. Okay, maybe. Maybe this isn't like anything crazy. I don't know, cause I don't really know what a texture, well, if I say I don't know what a texturizer looks like, that's gonna sound like a lie, cause I just told y'all that I watched a bunch of videos. But maybe the kid version is different from the adult version, cause I didn't really watch anybody do, there's still chemicals in here, I can smell it. I'm still gonna be really cautious. Maybe I should read. Wait, who's gonna tell me what's? Children's no lie texturizer. What does no lie mean? So this bottom piece is what I'm gonna have to mix with this. I just wanna know what this does. Let me read the instructions. That's probably why I should. Yeah, yeah. If these are brain Mona. Thank God this came with gloves. I was about to. And it came with a stick, but I'm probably not gonna use that. All right. I hate big papers like this. I'm just not gonna lie. 
This is a lot of instructions. So this system contains instruction sheet, a wooden spatula, plastic gloves, liquid activator, texture softening cream, anti-breakage oil, color code, neutralizing shampoo, conditioner. You'll also need a wide tooth comb, I got that. Towels, I'll probably use this t-shirt. Timer, clock, jelly, I got that. Hair clamps, I don't have a lot of hair. So I'm tripping. Do not use if your scalp is irritated. Do not use on bleached, permanently colored, or dyed, or tinted hair. <laughs> we gonna pretend like we didn't hear that. Ooh, I'm just kind of scared. What if my hair falls off? Yo, I. It's the way I will shave my head tomorrow. Like I really am not tripping for real. I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing, y'all. It's okay. We're gonna test the limits. Do not use on treated with progressive color. Do's and don'ts. Read all warnings. Do follow all instructions carefully. Do check scalp condition carefully before you use. Do a strand test. Maybe I should do that. Maybe that could be the only good thing that I do in this video. I think I'm gonna do that. Thoroughly apply, mix, liquid activator. <laughs> Don't shampoo hair for at least 48 hours prior. Oh, prior. Don't scratch, brush, or otherwise irritate, stimulate, stimulate scalp products. Use, don't use it for those extra time being removed. Do not stretch hair during application. Don't use heat, don't touch up your growth for at least eight weeks. Start timing from the moment you begin applying. The combined application and process of time is not exceeding 12 weeks. Maximum time to show below. Color code, slightly darker than the color of your hair. Color slash bleached hair. Do not use, do not use, do not use. Font. It's really giving me a lot of warnings. Maybe I really shouldn't do it. But I'm gonna do it anyway. Bruh, it literally gave me three warnings. It gave me a lot of warnings. So if you have fine hair, you should be applying for four to five minutes and processing for five to six minutes. So the total should be like 11 minutes. If you have medium hair, four to five minutes, five to eight minutes processing, 13 minutes total. Coarse kinky hair, five to seven minutes, seven to nine minutes, 16 minutes total. This is like a whole math equation, but on my head. I'm gonna try to apply this all within five to seven minutes. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna do what it says, instead of trying to do my own thing. Cause I don't know why I'm trying to figure this out. When I clearly don't know what I'm doing, I should just follow the direction. Let's do this. Let me get my phone. They want me to put it in ponytails. I ain't got hair. That's what it says do not smooth. Which I think a lot of people miss because when I watch videos, they always end up smoothing it. And it says, do not smooth with your hands or apply tension to the hair as this may make your hair too straight. Baby, this is supposed to be texturizing the hair. Okay, let me go ahead and put this shampoo in the shower. I'm really gonna need it, apparently. <laughs> y'all, I'm prepared, cause right after I apply this, I'm jumping in the shower. Let me go ahead and start dividing my hair. Ooh, y'all nervous. I wanna back this up so y'all can see the whole process. This exposure. Please. I feel like a grown woman. Like, this is really giving me flashbacks to my childhood around my ears deep down i don't give a f but i'm about to like put some effort into it you know sheesh okay Oof, i'm just combing out my curls i should stop doing that let's be a little gentle i don't know what my goal is for this we're just gonna see what happens Ooh, this is really oily oil Ooh, it smells good Oof. Ooh, I'm actually getting flashbacks right now. <laughs> Thinking the black girls. Can y'all imagine what this smells like? Like, I know y'all know what this smells like. I think I was supposed to add the oil. Okay, let's add the other half of the oil. I'm nervous. That's why I'm f***ing up right now, y'all. Let me slide, let me slide, okay? Okay, and you're done. I already put the activating juice bull in there. I got nervous because it said do not let it sit for 30 minutes. So I don't want to sit here and be reading for 30 minutes and not doing anything because I'm trying to read everything over and over again. We're now mixing the potion. And I'm ready to apply this, y'all. This is it. Do or die. I'm going to put this down a little bit lower. The timer has started. Ooh, I'm scared. Okay. Okay. Oh. I'm really doing it. Okay, we're gonna start with the back of my head. Starting with the back of my head, starting with the back of my head. Okay, okay I have a lot of time. I I'm not gonna rush it, rush it. Oh, she said don't smooth, don't smooth, okay. Why am I calling her she? I don't know who wrote those instructions. Why do I feel like it's already working? I'm kind of scared. I'm a little nervous, I'm a little nervous, I'm a little nervous. I'm nervous, get this top of the head, ooh. ooh. 
think it's already working. Or that could just because my hair is literally dyed. I gotta think about that. Y'all, is this a mistake? Is this a mistake? We're far too deep in it now. Let's see. It's definitely working. Um, yeah, this is scary. Oh, hell no. Oh, my God. Um, it literally, did it take away my color? It literally took away my color. Jesus Christ. Oh. Ooh. It's real straight. Okay. We gotta get in the shower now. Now. No. Did I put my hair? Hello guys. I just took another shower. And I just had to regroup and fully wash my body that time. I'm gonna come back tomorrow and we're gonna make work with what we have. I don't know if I should show y'all. Man. I'm thinking, I'm so glad I didn't leave it on for 10 minutes cause shoo, maybe I, well, I, I was aware that my hair was bleached and colored and I literally didn't listen. But it's not <laughs> too bad. Trust me, I know it looks bad, it's the color, but. This is what it is. This is what it is, y'all. Hold on, let me not flash myself. Let me fix myself up real quick. Um, it's the color. It just looks really nasty. We're gonna fix it. So, um, yeah. I'm gonna be back tomorrow, and we're gonna be done up in queue, and my hair's gonna be the best it can be after this. I was hoping I wasn't gonna look high, but I do. I feel like I enhanced my eyes, my eye area so much that I just kind of made it obvious. I thought I was true, I was like, yo, my, are my eyes red or like, but yeah. I'm cooked right now. Here's my hair. <laughs> Y'all, it was so questionable whenever I came out the shower. Probably looking like, wow, like your hair survived that. I'm surprised too, trust me. I had the greatest day today. Like my day really turned into something I didn't think it was gonna turn into. I met this girl at the park. It was like the middle of the day and we ended up hanging out all day. It's like almost 10 o'clock now. And she went home like 30 minutes ago. One thing for sure is um, it's not recommended that you do this. Like obviously this is not, this doesn't make it okay to try to relax or texturize bleached and dyed hair. Cause my hair is really damaged and I knew what I was doing and it did fry my hair. It did texturize it, but really only the top. And now the top is like fried. It looks good, but it's just cause I'm good with keeping up my, with my hair and I'm gonna make sure that it's moisturized and stuff every day now, like way more because it's very dry. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. I don't want somebody to watch this and be like, oh my God, this is like, no, this is not a tutorial. It's not like an instructional video. It is all for entertainment purposes. What I did was like, not what you're supposed to do. I got lucky because I really saw it coming and I was just like, bro, I, I did have to record it. I was like, I can't just do this and then come back on camera. Like, I have to record this whole process because this was risque. I feel like I'm just rambling, <laughs> which I am. I look really cute. And that smoke session was so fun. I can't wait to hang out with her game. That we had the best time. Like, it was storming outside too. Like, we was out there at first and then we came over here because she had to pee and then we just smoked again in here. And I broke my bong. That's another funny thing, but it was so funny. But it was so sad because I just got that bong and I didn't even get to give it a name yet. I got two interviews for two jobs. And my sister wants me to try and work both, so I think I can do that. I am fried. I'm so cute to lie. I look like a fairy. But yeah, I look like her. I am her. Do you see this? I am that fairy. Okay, but I'm gonna go, y'all. That was the video. I kind of feel bad because I'm like, dang, I didn't show y'all what I was doing, like with my hair or anything, but I can tell y'all what I did. Last night, all I did was rinse out that stuff and put grease on it. What else did I put on it? Like a lot of grease. And then like, it was wet whenever I went to bed. And then when I woke up, it was still kind of wet. But it wasn't wet enough to like style while it was wet. It was just like kind of like nasty. You know, like sleep and damn. It's not wet enough, it's not dry enough. So I just washed my hair again. I did a shampoo to get the grease out. And then 
I just put the dye on my head. When my hair was like dry. I put the dye on just stripped hair. So it would like pick up the color good because I didn't have that much dye left. I think this is what happened. I'm really high, so I can't really remember step by step. Because I really don't even follow step by step. I don't follow directions ever. But I'm gonna go. I'm gonna clean. It's not messy. Y'all gonna see this. This is what I was talking about with my freaking with that girl that came over. I was telling her these big ass bugs, y'all. Those are like palm tree bugs or some shit. I can't stand them. Where is my camera? Bro, what is going on? I'm scared. Can those fly? I hope not. As y'all can see, last night was a disaster, but a good kind of disaster. And I did find the bug. That roach of a palm tree bug or whatever the they are like oh but um i never ended up filming an outro because my camera ran out of space and i ended up falling asleep that is this video here's my hair not fully dry like it was like last night i re-wet it and styled it for an interview that i had today uh so yeah that's the update my hair is pretty much fried at the top if we're being completely honest but it doesn't look bad like that's what i'm saying i really am gonna leave my hair alone i'm gonna let it like grow and stuff that's not a promise, but I'm gonna really try my hardest and I'm not gonna like torture it any longer. There's no reason for me to. I'm really gonna chill. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. Comment anything you'd like to comment. Subscribe. Join the family. But don't join the family if you're not gonna watch my videos. Don't subscribe if you're not gonna watch my videos. Because why would you do that? And yeah, remember to stay whelmed, never overwhelmed. And I can't wait to see you guys in my next video. Goodbye.